Hi guys, what's up? It's me, Jimmy Agi. Sometimes some companies really become monopoly, like Intel have become. Basically, Intel is charging more than giving us the performance out there. I'm not saying Intel processor are not good, but compared to AMD, Intel give you if you go to the price for the performance for ratio price. Basically, AMD is much better. But there's a sad news. I don't know what the hell is going through AMD mind. They really want to make the Intel as a monopoly. So if you know what AMD is thinking to abandon their FX line. Basically, AMD is trying to think that they are going to abandon their desktop processor. If that happen, Intel will have no bloody competition for anyone. They will just become a monopoly like the Comcast had become. Like the Comcast, the the cable TV, the cabling company has become. Direct monopoly. So when that happened, when AMD really officially announced that they are going to abandon their FX series, their desktop processor, Intel is going to make the price rise. No, not only on the higher end processor, even on the lower end processor. If you go with the lower end processor like i3, i3 is so expensive compared to AMD FX six six three hundred. And then the FX6300 offer you much better performance than the i3. Yes, I know AMD higher end processor like FX8350 or what was the name called FX9590, FX9570. Sorry, the 5 gigahertz one processor does not give you good performance. But that does not mean AMD you should give. Please, AMD. Nothing basic something is better than nothing for Intel basically if you are trying to abandon a desktop processor market Intel is going to become a monopoly Intel is going to charge charge through our nose money we, we are uh, Intel is really going to bleed our money out from us basically do not do it AMD please AMD try to survive do whatever the hell you want do the partnership with someone there are a lot of company even go with Lenovo Lenovo can help you or basically Lenovo has bought the Motorola even they have bought the IBM division think by division at this point Lenovo has so much money just you can you can you can ask the help of Lenovo company a Chinese company who manufactured tier one equipment tier one computer tier one laptop do not please try to abandon the desktop processor. You don't know AMD. What the hell you are doing? I am the AMD fanboy. Yes, I am the AMD fanboy. All my life I had used AMD processor. AMD was the one of the first processor which offered a first one gigahertz processor, first dual core processor, first cute core processor, first uh, triple or well, not triple core, six core processor. First eight core processor AMD. You are the first. Even you are the first one to offer the five gigahertz processor unlock. Please AMD, do not abandon the desktop line. If the F FX line, uh, if the processor FX line sucks, who the hell cares? A lot of company have up and down, but that does not mean you should just abandon the desktop market and then just try to become Intel and monopoly. No way! At this point, Intel i7 5820K is costing around 400 US dollars. So much expense. To be honest with you, AMD, you can just come with the same performance per, per processor at 300 US dollars. There's no doubt you have you have done in it. Please guys, please guys try to leave your comments below, share this video, even if you do not want to share this video, just try to talk about it, just try to write it on Facebook, on social media, try to write blogs on it, even I'm writing an article on it, just try to make AMD hear our voice, AMD we are with you, and basically if, and, and my message is to even to the AMD fanboy, where the hell is AMD fanboy? Now AMD fan, AMD fan, but AMD really need your support. AMD is feeling alone in isolation. Nobody is even giving the crap to them. Please, AMD, you are not alone. We are with you. I beg you for a sec. Please do not feel in isolation. We are with you. Doesn't matter. You just the next one year. Do not come up with a new processor. But do not abandon it. Try to work on a new 18 millimeter, 20 millimeter. I we know 32 millimeter processor does not offer good performance like AMD FX8350 is 32 millimeter. Intel is already offering a 22 millimeter processor. But please, please, you engineer, hire some new engineer, do whatever. Add, 
just just do whatever just try to build a new processor which is going to compete with the i7 just do not give up please do it in uh, amd please do it you can fight intel i know i'm gonna receive the intel fan but who the hell can i love intel i'm I, I, basically i'm going to buy the intel i7 520k because quite fast processor but basically i have to use intel i can understand intel over but still at the same time i have used a lot my uh, um, my one of my older gaming rigs i'm using a fx a, a 350 i love basically amd processor amd ps4 and xbox one are using your processor to be, I, I want to make one thing clear amd and inter processor offer you nothing different when you do in gaming most of amd fanboy a gamer most of the guys who buy i7 are basically gamers just try to amd try to come try to focus on the gaming market you have your solar gaming upcoming gaming graphic card next gen gpu you have the mental uh, what, what was mental or oh, mental whatever it was called mental under your un, under your grip basically mental is quite good just try to refine it just try to refine the architecture of it the 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 what was it called the, the signal processing basically which mental have some problem basically it, it decreased the quality sometime to give you a better performance just try to solve that issue amd please please try not to please try do not to give up the fx or whatever desktop processor line which are thinking do not give up please give a tough competition to intel we know you will survive amd you will survive i'm your biggest fan but do not worry we all are with you and Please guys leave your comment below and then just try to support AMD, try to make AMD feel that we are with them. If, if by God, if by God, I, I bear witness as my God, if by God this happened, Intel is going to rise their processor prices and then all of you guys are going to scream like monkey. Ah, wah, wah, wah. And then do not blame me. Just remember one thing Jimmy Agric told you. If you do not take this thing seriously, if you just take as a fun, who the hell cares? You are going to suffer. I am going to suffer. Basically, this suffrage is gonna change the industry, it's gonna rise the price. You cannot build a budget PC anymore if the enterprise interprocessor is gone up. Basically, prices. Basically, I will say AMD, please, please, please. And all of you guys, please support AMD and try to hear, try to loud your voice, try to AMD hear you write on social media tweet it write on facebook just try to say amd we are with you and please subscribe to my channel if you hate me just hate me if you like me just like me today i become very emotional i'm an amd fan but there's no doubt in it i love you amd